Uh, this is just a quick video ladies, um, it's a project that I've made for Vivian Garbit. that's Vivian3108 here on YouTube and she asked me to, to uh, make a sewing box for her and um, I wasn't quite sure about the colours, um, I said I'd make one for her with pleasure um, with the fabrics that I've already got. So. I'm showing this so that Viv can see it and if she doesn't like the colours well I'll make another one. Um, this one is made up of uh, it's all cotton uh, hearts and postcards I've forgotten the name it's a milder fabric I think um, just a romantic um, type of uh, fabric. Uh, the top there's um, a gathered organza flower with another on the inside and a little red heart and a uh, ribbon tie. In fact Viv gave me that bu button and I thought it would match up perfectly with this. So that's the box, the sewing box. It's about, about six by four, something like that. The top is padded. Um, I'll open it out. The inside of the box is padded as I usually do. You could use that as a, a pink cushion. Um, right, uh, the contents. On the inner section, let's have a little look. Um, I've got a thread cutter, and that's in in red just to match. Um, here we've got some needle threaders, a little pin cushion in the centre, uh, some safety pins. Here we've got a, um, a fold out, it's a plastic tape measure and it's just useful for places that uh, you know you can't get your, your tape or you could put that in front of your sewing machine when you're working. It's just useful that you can uh, you know just roll it up Um, right, so oh, here we've got, um, let me just fetch that out, a little button card, and a little, I'll put a little tag on the inside, I'll just pop my name on there so that she knows. It's from me. In case she gets into a dotage and she can't remember who she is or who I am or what we are. <laughs> oh, perish the thought. Um, just a little heart shaped button there on a ball pin and uh, and that's um, a stitch marker there. The little. A little red stitch marker there. There's a button. So those are the four inner sections, the small sections. On the outside we've got um, right in one pocket. I did a lace pocket with a pen inside. Here we've got um, a bobbin holder, just squeeze the end and the bobbin comes out. I just put some cream thread in there. Um, on this side we've got uh, needles. 
and a little book of uh, notelets. In this pocket, I've popped uh, another tape measure, but this is uh, I just press the button in the middle. So I've got an extra tape measure there. Um, let's we're on to the last one, and we've got a seam ripper on this side, and I managed to get some red scissors online and I made a, a red fuchsia scissor keep just a little bit of decoration so I'll pop that in there so that's for Vive now Vive um, I'll post that tomorrow if it's okay for you if you prefer something else a different type of material or just let me know. I, I won't mind in the least. But um, I thought that was quite quite lovely that fabric. Everything's hand stitched. I must do um, a tutorial because a couple of ladies want to uh, learn how to do it. Everything is hand stitched, but the inside padded items are glued to the outers. But the base is stitched to the inner base. It takes me about three days to sit and do one. Okay, ladies, thanks for looking in, and hope you like that, Viv. Bye for now. Bye.